We begin with that breaking news. It is a tragedy in a Chester County neighborhood as fire leaves a mother and her child dead overnight. But apparently they live in an apartment on the second floor of one of these row homes. Officials say the middle home, just second from the end, was where the fire originally began. And unfortunately, that mother and her son did not have working smoke detectors inside their home. If we had working smoke detectors throughout this occupancy, I think the outcome may have been different. And while firefighters say there were no working smoke detectors in the apartment where the fire started, there were working smoke detectors elsewhere in the building. And it was one of those smoke detectors, that alarm in the apartment upstairs that one neighbor tells us alerted her, her husband, and her infant of the flame. We were awoken by our smoke detector at about midnight. Uh, my husband opened our bedroom door, saw there was smoke in the hall. He banged on the door, yelled fire um, to tell the other person on our floor. We're on the third floor and woke him up. We were going to go down the steps, get out of the house as quickly as possible. We weren't able to do that because of the smoke. It is just too engulfed. Opened the bedroom um, window, went out on the roof on the third floor, uh, called 911 and waited for uh, them to come and bring the ladder so we could climb down.